I can just tell you that actually it does not matter uh, with which software you use for your work or for your career because the time that you just calculate something for sure all the calculation formula again are based on ISA 70.01 same as the thing that we've already did for case of RFEs could you remember something about that part I just you know use two different uh, software sizing for the RFEs the first one was Daniel and the second one was InstruCalc and I'm totally sure you could remember we just finally compared the result of two software and we found out that both of them actually were the same so again in this situation if you just use uh, FSM and then for example you use another one for sure the result would be totally or approximately the same but again I can just you know ask you to use these types of softwares which are related to a company or a brand uh, to get the uh, sizing result okay so come to here please when you just uh, open up your uh, software you will just see something just like that okay then on project you need to uh, put a right click then choose a uh, new project even you can just write the uh, project name too for example I don't know injection or isomerization a light NAFTA project this is actually just related to the name of your project after that you should just put another right click on it and then put or choose the new tag okay as you can see there's a kind of data sheet that has been just generated and now you can see different types of tabs here it was the first thing that I just told you this one is ISA sheet let me just click on it it was a thing that you've already saw so uh, with the help of this FSM I can just tell you that there is no need even to uh, prepare any data sheet why because uh, simultaneously uh, this item or this software prepares or generates a data sheet for you too so it means that you can just you know open up the FSM software and then you just fill all your data inside and after that you will be able to understand a sheet which is related for technical matters and you can just use it for a case of data sheet as well okay so here you have some possibility to just write the name of your tags even as you can just see this one is tag one so you can just even uh, put a click on it and then rename it to the thing that you like it was just if we I can just put if we and uh, you can write 21001 as you can see and as you can see you know the difference uh, has been just implemented here too about the name of project and the quantity maybe you want to for example mention about some descriptions about the name of your customer the fax number contact actually all these items are general things and you can just fill it uh, you know as you wish about the parts that you can find here you are not able to fill them if you just complete these tabs that you can see above these parts will be a field consequently so here you do not have this ability to fill so after finishing this part you need to go to next tab can you see that installation data I'm here now step by step you need to finish them the first item is related for style so you need to choose the style of your valve this one is glob about the rating uh, it was chosen as class 300 so I chose it next one is related for nominal inlet pipe size if you remember it was 6 inches so I'm choosing 6 and the dimension is inch the schedule is 40 as you could remember and for nominal of outlet again I need to put 6 then the related schedule is 42 uh, about the end connection it was raised face flange so I choose raised face about the maximum allowable noise it was 85 about the body and bonnet you can just you know choose anything that you like otherwise you can just 
put it into manufacturer standard. If you ask me, I can just tell you that you can just choose manufacturer standard. And even for case of <clears throat> stop and not, again, you can just, for example, choose uh, ASTM A193, for example, or other things. But again, you ask me, I can just, you know, put it into manufacturer standard again. About the case of design pressure, you need to put the uh, design pressure for in this case, as you could remember, it was 15.5 and it was actually absolute of the bar, so it's bar A, here is bar A, I can just check my data sheet, and yes, it's correct, it's bar A, and next item is related for design temperature, it was just, uh, I suppose, 87, yes, it was 87 degree of Celsius. Okay, about the ANSI shutoff class, it was uh, class four, as you can see, it's class four. And next one, we need to put next.